Morgan Britton. I hail from the University of Iowa in Iowa City, Iowa. Um, I'm in the MA program there in art history, and I'm the Charles M. Russell short-term fellow here at the Helmreich Center for American Research this summer. So my project deals with the depictions of boats in Charles Russell's work. I'm thinking about the ways in which boats in Charles Russell's work reflect uh, not only the time he's working in, he's working late 19th and early 20th century, but also how they reflect his views on that time. So the ways in which the world is really uh, adapting relatively quickly, technology is advancing at a relatively rapid pace. Um, so I'm thinking about those sorts, of, those sorts of ideas in my research. And the reason I'm here is that there's this amazing collection, uh, the Charles M. Russell Research Collect Collection, um, also known as the Britzman Archive. Uh, it's about 11,000 objects, I think. Uh, includes correspondence, includes photographs, sketches, other art objects that have been really interesting for my research. So I'm really fortunate in that uh, the Britzman Archive, the Charles M. Russell Research Collection, is all digitized. So when I was thinking about uh, research projects, I really had this thematic interest in the depiction of boats in the late 19th and early 20th century, um, and I was looking at places to potentially do my research. And because there's this digitized archive here at the Helmreich Center for American Research, um, I was able to sort of start mining through these uh, photographs, these sketches, these other archival materials that are located here um, in advance of my visit. To have an opportunity at the master's level to do independent research um, is a great sort of footing to be on as I go farther in my ac academic career, as I go on uh, for a PhD to, to have this experience doing archival research, um, having the space to really um, read through some secondary scholarship as well as theory, as well as invest in these primary materials that are here in the collection um, is just totally invaluable and something that frankly you don't have the time for during the school year. So um, I'm grateful to be here um, and really excited about uh, the, the opportunity and uh, all the things that I've found this summer. I think the real standout from the trip you know, I'd had the opportunity to look through the digitized version of the archive, but nothing really replaces going through a physical archive. So I think the real standout was just the sheer quantity of material that I was able to get um, from, this, from this trip. It's a totally unique experience to have a really rich archival resource in one building uh, and be able to walk uh, just really you know, 20 steps um, across the parking lot into the other building, the Gilcrease Museum, and be able to see all these uh, priceless works by Russell. It's really, frankly, invaluable as an art historian to be able to do uh, not only archival research, but also be able to see the objects that you're dealing with. Um, and to be able to do both those things in the same place uh, is pretty incredible.